Hey what's up guys, Chris here from Talk Nerdy To Me with another haul video. This time it's not a weekly comic book haul, it is in fact my latest eBay haul. So I'm going to show off my latest online buys. So here is my stack, it's so heavy I can barely lift it, it's a big one, there we go. That's quite a stack we've got there. So I'm going to go through it all now and show you what I've got. So first of all, I picked up some back issues, um, just some singles of stuff that I wanted to catch up on. So first up, I picked up issue one of The Terrifics. I was going to avoid this title, but I heard some good recommendations. Uh, it's part of DC Universe's New Age of Heroes lineup. It's an issue one, so I'm looking forward to jumping on it. Hope it's good. Written by Jeff Lemire, so it probably will be. So yeah, looking forward to checking this out after the good reviews that I've heard. I picked up three back issues of X-Men Blue. Uh, I dropped off this title when there was a big event going on. I think it was Venom crossover and there was another one before that. So I haven't read this for a while, uh, but there's a new storyline called Cry Havoc. So I wanted to catch up with that and pick up the next issue, which is out tomorrow. So I picked up the last three back issues of that. Issues 23, 24 and 25 and I really do like X-Men Blue, it's written by Colin Bunn and I love the covers, there we go, you see uh, Bloodstorm and Jimmy Hudson on that one, got that one with Magneto and Havoc on, it's a pretty cool cover and this one which is the latest one, issue 25 which features an all new lineup of the team so I'm interested to catch up with X-Men Blue, should be cool I'm looking forward to picking up the latest issue tomorrow. And now for the trades. This big stack of trades. Look at that. Mixture of hard covers and soft covers there. So first up, on the recommendation of my good buddy Field Mouse from Comic Crypt Podcast, I picked up X Factor. This is over 10 years old now, this run. It's by Peter David. But Field Mouse has recommended it to me because I wanted to read some X Factor, some old X Factor stuff. So he recommended this one. The Longest Night, which I think is the first trade in Peter David's run. Like I say, it's been recommended to me by someone that knows the X-Men stuff. I'm looking forward to checking this out. And next up, I picked up a couple of really nice looking hardback trades. Um, they're actually UK reprints of some Ultimate comics from Marvel. Uh, Ultimate was um, a brand that Marvel Comics put out a few years back where it was basically an entirely separate universe of the Marvel heroes that you know and love. I've heard that this Mark Millar run was actually really cool and helped to inspire the Marvel Cinematic Universe that we know and love. So before Infinity War comes out tomorrow, um, <laughs> I intended to catch up on these. As you can see, they're still sealed. So I got volumes one and two of this, of Ultimates. So yeah, I'm going to eventually get around to reading them and hope they're as good as everyone's been going on about. And finally, I picked up trades one, two, and three of the New 52 uh, Green Lantern core from DC Comics. I have been reading a lot of Green Lantern lately. I'm actually trying to catch up from the New 52 stuff to current day. I used to be a huge Green Lantern fan, and I've actually read more Green Lantern stuff probably than anything else. Um, I used to go to my local library and read the Golden Age stuff, then moved on to the Silver. So I'm basically trying to read everything Green Lantern, and this is where I'm up to. I originally bought some single issues as the run was coming to an end, and now I just wanted to go back and catch up. So I'm going to try and get all the trades that you can see, volumes one, two, and three. I do love me some Green Lantern, and reading the Green Lantern core books is pretty cool because obviously it's not focused on Hal Jordan, there's loads of other Green Lanterns, really cool cast of characters in there, so I'm looking forward to eventually catching up. So that's it for this haul, hope you've enjoyed seeing what I've bought. I'm going to Liverpool tomorrow to pick up my books for the week, stay tuned, see you then.